go. Here we are, four time with Myriad. We have an audience back there, believe it or not. Yeah, Those yeah. on the camera you don't know, but there's people here. Uh, we're coming at you first time in a couple weeks because yeah. we were off last week with a holiday break and also because uh, Anna's entire family was sick as well as mine, so yep. we uh, needed to rest. Yes, and, babies are germ factories. Uh, germ out. factories are the children. But that's okay because we're here and we're healthy. Yes. And we're going to share with you a little bit of what's happening in 2024 yeah. that we're really, really excited about. So we have a couple different additions for next year and we're going to uh, speak specifically on one called the CrossFit Deep Dive, which will be on the last Wednesday of every month. December, we'll probably make some adjustments. Maybe, maybe some even November. Maybe November. So, but for the first couple the months first of few months, it'll be normal. 2024, yeah. <laughs> uh, the last Wednesday of each month at 6.30 p.m. And we'll talk about the details here in a second. What is CrossFit Deep Dive, Deep Dive and what does it mean to you? Yeah, so... Uh, what this means to me is it's an opportunity to take an hour long session and really focus in on one or two movements um, or like a movement family. Mm. So like it might be, you know, things on the rig, like pull ups, toes to bar that, you know, while they're not the same movement, they have a lot of um, things that overlap. So those are things that we do in class on a pretty regular basis, but Often they are paired with other things and we don't necessarily have the time to get really into the nitty gritty of how to do them, how to do them more efficiently. And this session, these deep dives are going to give us that opportunity to really take a, a longer time period to focus in on some of those higher level movements or sometimes those really simple movements. Um, I think sometimes it can feel like, why are we not doing this all the time in all of our classes? And I think that really speaks to the purpose of CrossFit and the programming stimulus of being general physical preparedness. If we were always going really slow, diving into the technique every single day, we would never get the intensity side and we need to have a balance of both. Yeah. So. yeah, no, and that's a, a perfect description, perfect example. Uh, the thing I will add to that is just the fact that like, the maturity of our facility. Mm. You know, we've been here for, this is year 13, so yeah. we've been doing CrossFit for 13 years. Uh, and sometimes, not sometimes, classes are different when you're a 13 year gym versus when you're a six month old gym yeah. or you're a one year old gym. You know, in the very first, you know, years one through four, you're learning together as a member, as an athlete, as a coach, you're learning with those individuals and how you're teaching and running classes is different from an infant, Infant gym? Can gyms be infant? A gym in its infancy, infancy. <laughs> in its infancy versus a gym that would be in the veteran category that's been yeah. here for a really long time. So this is an opportunity for us to create a different type of platform where we can do that deep dive. Dive deep. Um, mm -hmm. A couple things I will also add to that is we really want to encourage, not that we don't encourage questions in classes, but sometimes, you know, to the point of we're doing a lot in classes, there is a lesson plan for classes. It's sometimes harder to have that time to really, really, really dive even deeper with certain specific questions. And that's what this platform is for mm -hmm. specifically. So come with questions um, that you may have with the movements we're going to be reviewing in that time frame. Uh, what does that game plan, that schedule look like for us mm -hmm. in January? Maybe we can even touch on a couple of the first yeah. couple months, but January, what does that, that look like? First of all, January 24th, Wednesday, 6.30 p.m. We'll talk a little bit about CrossFit and like who's this for and everything here in a second, but January's programming, what does that look like? Yeah, so one of our goals with this as much as possible is to mirror the program focuses that we will have on a monthly basis for the gym overall. and. Uh, the first two, three months of the year, we're going to be really gearing up for the CrossFit Open that begins mm -hmm. in March. Um, so this first month of the CrossFit Deep Dive, we're going to be going into movements that we will likely see in the CrossFit Open and trying to be more efficient at them. So um, burpees is a perfect example of something that we do all the time in class. And it's a pretty simple movement. You can look at a burpee and most anyone can just go out and do one. But there are 
little nuances of that movement and ways to do them uh, more efficiently to help you gain more seconds or more um, energy efficiency as you're working through that movement to help you perform at a higher level in a workout like the open workouts. So that's going to be an example of one of the movements we'll be doing in January. Barbell cycling is another one that, you know, we can be more efficient with it. It's diff how we treat a, uh, an open workout with a lot of reps, high reps of a barbell movement is very different from how we treat, you know, a heavy single in an Olympic lift. And how do we manage that? How do we do that more efficiently? Um, and then also just general pacing. Um, I think it's something we will touch on here and there in class, but um, it's not something that we always have time to really get into the nitty gritty of how to pace as best as possible to get the best performance on your workouts. Yeah. And Anna broke this down perfectly in a sense of what a session will look like, yeah. right? So it's going to be an hour long class. Um, some of the details on that are it's going to replace the 6.30 p.m. CrossFit class. Yeah. And what we want to do is still have a high intensity piece to that. So mm -hmm. people who are coming to the 6.30 p.m. class traditionally and do come to that 6.30 p.m. class, they're still going to get a workout. Yeah, you're still going to get a workout. You're still going to get moving. Exactly. So that example of, you know, we'll talk about burpees. We'll go through burpee efficiency. We'll go through some barbell cycling. Um, we'll talk a little about pacing and then we'll do the workout and or do a workout that involves those yeah, things. Yeah, get to practice and what you learn. So the future sessions on the CrossFit Deep Dives will be very similar from like an agenda perspective or mm -hmm. a lesson plan perspective as well. Some days we might only go over one movement, but then we'll do a workout with that movement. Some yeah. days we'll go over a ton of different movements and um, be able to have a small little workout from there. Yes. Perfect. Um, Tell me a little bit about like who this is for, who's coaching it, what's that going to look like? Yeah, so the goal is to so um, have different coaches leading this yeah. this session. I, in the first couple, I'll probably be leading. Uh, there might be opportunities where we have more than one coach, depending mm. on if we see a lot of traction with this and we start to see you know, 20, 30, 40 people coming on Wednesday nights, which yes. would be amazing to see. Dream big. Uh, yeah, right? We dream big. Then we'll, we'll have more coaches available for mm -hmm. there. So please take a look at your calendars now. I believe they are on Pike 13 already. Mm -hmm. Schedule ahead of time for these so we have a good understanding of how many people will be there. So we know from an equipment perspective uh, what we'll need as well. Um, but with that, we'll also have specific individuals. For example, when we go over gymnastics movements, who better to have than the vice president of USA Gymnastics men's gymnastics team, yeah. aka Coach Jason Woodnick. That's an incredible um, resource to learn from. <laughs> another example is when we go over rowing, which I think we have slated for November, That's the which plan. again, all TBD on we could change things a little bit. But you know, Coach Kelly would be a great example who has a, 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 a rowing background who would be able to help us uh, greatly in that scenario. You know, we have a couple people who know how to weightlift. You know, someone who's actually weightlifted for the USA national team before. I don't know who that is. I'm not uh, sure you could really call it exactly that, but that is um, kind of you to say. What and would you call we it? All, well, you had a USA uniform on uh, in Malta. It's not quite the same, but. It may Thank not have you. been the Olympics, <laughs> was, but still, no. <laughs> you were wearing a USA jersey. I think that the USA Weightlifting Federation would have words to say uh, with that title being given to me. Uh, okay. But we do, I, I have lifted and we also internationally, have and Dan we have a coach and, who yes, um, has team. coached athletes to that uh, level as well. Absolutely. So that's a great example of where if we have weightlifting as a movement, we might just take the snatch and just work on a snatch for an hour. We might, you know, use the clean and clean and do the clean for an hour. We might do the jerk. We're not 100% sure exactly what the flow will look like because a lot of times uh, you can go for an hour on some of these movements. So that will... This guy be, especially. Yeah, me, I can talk forever. <laughs> um, so those are things that we're going to be focused on. But that's the intent of the CrossFit Deep Dive. Yeah. And we didn't really talk about this, but this is for CrossFit only members. If CrossFit mm -hmm. is available in your membership, this is for you uh, because this is replacing a CrossFit class. And we it's will just still once have our 6 p.m. Uh, boot camp class on that those evenings as well. Correct. So there will be a little bit of overlap with that boot camp class finishing at 645. But um, if you're a boot camp member, it's not like the gym isn't open to you that evening. Yeah. 
Um, just a quick, because we have a quick 20 seconds, February we're looking to do more open movements. So if there's mm -hmm. specific movements you want to work on, please share feedback with us like, hey, I'd love to dive deeper yeah. on this. Um, and then March we're going to start getting into a little bit of weightlifting focus. And then April into some running, some pose method running. So we learn how to run correctly yeah. um, because we'll start getting into the, that running season. So um, look at that. Perfect timing. Go us. Was going to end excited. it anyways. <laughs> CrossFit Deep Dives, last Wednesday of the month, 6.30 p.m. Sign up beforehand. You don't have to sign up beforehand, but we encourage you to do so. Let's get a numbers idea, but hope to see you there. Yep. Thank you. <laughs>